In this day and age, we can't be using Stone Age solutions for our modern problems. I mean, that doesn't even make sense in a sentence. Instead, we must be using modern problems to solve our mod. We need... Today, we're going to look at some memes. Hey, what's going on guys, and welcome back to the Sumeto Media Show, the comedy talk show you can tune into every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. The only comedy talk show that makes you 10 inches taller just by subscribing to the channel. It's crazy, you should give it a go. Now, it is a fantastic week for black men in the meme culture. Dave Chappelle from ages ago and Will Smith from like a week ago apparently, both have memes that are popping up extremely well, and they're both pretty funny. Now, I just want to assume that this is a coincidence. I mean, that'd be the rational thinking part of me. But I also kind of wonder if some people are mistaking Dave Chappelle for Will Smith and are just kind of upvoting anything they see with a relatively dark silhouette outside of it. You know who you are. Speaking of which, you know what other African-American movie star slash comedian is also in the current news at the moment? Kevin Hart. And I can't help but notice that these guys also have a bearing resemblance in these pictures. Ain't that great. Finally, I made it in my career and I can forget about a tweet I made when I was 16. Uh, wait a second. It's rewind time. I'm sorry, Kevin Hart, but when it comes to the Oscars, it looks like... He wasn't ready. He wasn't ready. I'm joking, obviously. It totally sucks that tweets that you made eight years ago that you've already apologized for can still come up and ruin opportunities that are happening in your career right now. But hey, modern problems need modern solutions. And Twitter is a modern problem. I mean, just off the top of my head, Laura Lee, James Gunn. I mean, so many people are just losing out because of stuff that they tweeted from so long ago. Why does anybody even use Twitter at this point? All it's doing is hurting you. Here's another modern problem. Chicks with dicks. Is it weird? Is it weird that it's not weird? And don't tell me that it started with TikTok because this thing's from Mulan. Dude said, call me old fashioned, but I like my women without a dick. <laughs> That's 2018 in a nutshell. Hit or miss. Okay class, flirting is now a school subject, so it's time to get smooth. Let's start with an example. Who wants to go first? Jose, get up here. If some hot piece catches your eye, what would you say? A hey girl. Do you got a dick or should I give you mine? Oh, what a fire pickup line. 2018 though. Me trying to figure out who 90% of the people in YouTube Rewind are. Now that is a modern problem. The modern solution would be to stop watching it. Why are you re-watching it? To, what? When you're going through a birth crisis but refuse to accept immigrants. Japanese problems require Japanese solutions. When you're against abortion, but you still don't want your kids. God, is that real? That can't be real. Who puts a park on our roof? Will I ever be as good as the old masters? Will I ever be as good as the old masters? Will I ever be the... I'm Casey Nice. Oh, man. You guys can't go five minutes without roasting my boy Casey. Come on now. You're not wrong. Will Smith's casting agent after seeing YouTube Rewind on his resume. You consider failure experience? I don't know why people think Will Smith's gonna go back to doing movies. He's like transitioned out of it. He's a YouTuber now. Accept him. Can you spot the mistake? Well, there's one single die in there that says YouTube Rewind on it, so I'm gonna I'm gonna guess it's that one. Good, good, nice, nice high quality meme, my guy. Parallel lines, two lines which never meet. Ah, yes, I learned this in chemistry. For example, YouTube Rewind and good content. The ones with PewDiePie were alright, the older ones. When your video becomes the second most disliked video within a week, yeah. I mean, Reddit really took off with that. It is literally the most disliked video right after Justin Bieber's baby. And they are actively trying to change it so that this is the most disliked video. When you like baby, so YouTube Rewind can be the most disliked video on YouTube. That's right. Modern problems require modern solutions. Stick it to the man. When the Fire Nation attacks, it's wind time. Wind to oh, wind time. What's wrong with me? At this point, is there a member of the Smith family that hasn't been a total meme? Jaden Smith has so many memes about him. Will Smith's now a meme. Even Willow had the memes about when she did whip my hair back and forth. 
Guess it's really just mom. We gotta get on that. Here is the bad, and here is the good. The bad that's in the good, the good that's in the bad. Here's life, and here's missing a Sumeto video. Hey, thanks my guy. When they ask you what color the YouTube logo is, it's red. Thank you, Will Smith. Very cool. When you fast forward through a porn video and they start eating ass, it's time to rewind. Yeah. I thought this meme was a little bit lazy, but th this is spot on. YouTube Rewind exists. Reddit. It's free real estate. At least the memes are getting better this time. These, these are a little bit higher quality than they were last video. All right. I've coddled you guys for long enough. Life isn't just sitting around looking at memes, okay? Sometimes you're gonna have to go out into the streets, maybe to get chicken tenders, and sometimes you're gonna get jumped, okay? And not only are you gonna get jumped, but you're gonna get jumped by some people who speak another language. And so I'm gonna teach you how to translate some of those languages. Through memes, of course. Imagine getting jumped by Elon Musk and he says SpaceX, SpaceX, SpaceX. That's not easy to say three times fast. Now remember, anytime that you're getting jumped by Elon Musk's and they say, this entire phrase is just tough to say. Anyway, uh, give this man a one-way ticket to Mars. Now instead, if you find yourself getting jumped by some literature aficionados and one of them says, remove his leg from all of thy connections, what that means is, yo, let's cut off his leg and see what happens. At that point, I would recommend biting your thumb and then drinking some fake poison and pretending to be dead until your boyfriend drinks some real poison and then actually dies right next to you. You guys better be appreciating these William Shakespeare jokes. I had to bring them out of the recesses of my high school English education. Hit the subscribe button. Imagine getting jumped by some memers and one of them says, and that means kill him in three days. <laughs> this one's actually pretty creative. I like that. Imagine getting jumped by some gamers and one of them says which means the fuck you say to me, you little shit? I'll have you know I have over 500 confirmed. Imagine getting jumped by YouTube Rewind and it says Fortnite, 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 which means take his terrible content and trends that aren't even from 2018. This is tweeted by Smash Mouth, by the way. Steve Harvey's wife among those arrested during a raid on a cocaine and orgy club. Name something that gets passed around, your wife? Oh, that's pretty good. Apple and the same phone, but for a larger price. You guys gotta stop making the meme so accurate, man. It's making me depressed. Hey, did you guys see the nominees for the Grammys this year? Looking pretty poopity scoop. Y'all root for people to succeed all the way up until they actually do. That's not true. I've done about 50 meme videos and 17 episodes of the Cemento Media Show, and people have been telling me to kill myself all the way through. Do you get it? Do you guys still remember this? I still remember this. Oh my god, I love you. I love you too. Prove it. Scream it to the world. I love you. Why'd you whisper it to me? Because you're at my uncle's funeral. Wah, 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 wah. Air horns, air horns. Make that meme. Last week, I gave you guys this picture, and I told you to label it to the funniest of your abilities down in the comments, and I'd pick my favorites and put them in this video. So let's take a look at how good you've gotten. Me, female presenting nipples. Ah, yes, the classic make the joke that I made for 10 minutes last time. Step up your game, Tato. I'm letting you off with a warning this time. Me, girl who goes to another school. Well, you kind of did the same thing there, didn't you, Bruce Juice? T-Series, Subbots. Hey, there you go. That's a good one. Goofy, the Milkman. Grab my ears while you fuck my butt. Go yuck. Normal drinks, Sprite Cranberry. It's festive for the thirstiest time of the year. Sumeto's comments, spelling coffee wrong. Did I purposely spell these words wrong? That seems like something I would do. Let's pretend I did this on purpose. Good joke, Peanut. All in all, very good memes. That template is not an easy one to use. I know I was a little bit harsh, but it's only because I want you guys to make the best memes you possibly can. Make that meme. Here's another example, parallel lines, two lines which never meet. Down in the comments using hashtag MTM lines, give me an example of two things that will never meet. 
I'll pick out my favorites and you can see me put it together for you in the next video. Shout out to Arudi for being the featured comment of the video. If you guys want to be featured in the next video, leave something funny down below. Remember to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss my videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I'll catch you guys in Wednesday's video. Peace.